the role of the internet has vast. I mean, I got in this field in 1960. In about 1995, the explosion on the internet with emails, with websites, with all of those things really changed the face of cryptozoology. Before that, I mean, literally, I would maybe, I'd have 400 correspondents and I'd exchange letters with them, I'd Xerox articles, I maybe would go to a few conferences, but the, the interchange was slower, the immediacy of news was not there, and you come to the internet, and the internet, I mean, uh, uh, just to put it frankly, a friend of mine who's a cryptozoologist died suddenly yesterday. And his family called me on the telephone, the old-fashioned telephone, and they said, we know you write a blog on CryptoMundo. Would you tell everybody in the cryptozoology community that Scott Norman died? And so I did, and I was able to touch thousands of people, literally. A CryptoMundo, my blog, gets anywhere between one and three million readers a month. So that's much different than corresponding with four hundred people during the 60s. I'm still corresponding one-to-one -one through private emails, but I get 500 emails a day. I mean, I'm literally, and that's not counting the 2,000 spam, 500 emails in which I have to pick out the 20 or 30 that are personal, that give me news, that need some immediate, I'm talking to people in Vietnam, in Australia. You know, I get up in the morning and I literally see the world waking up with the emails that come to me. Uh, and so the, the hardest part, of course, is when I have to tell everybody, I'm going to the swamps of Florida for a week. I'm not going to talk to you, you know. And so I need to have breaks occasionally because being a cryptozoologist, I want to be out in the field too. I want to go to libraries occasionally and do archival research. And I also do a lot of speaking engagements. Uh, two next week, uh, another one uh, in Ohio in April, you know. so. I'm always constantly trying to do the juggling between the, the wonderfulness of the internet, which takes an incredible amount of time. I, I have my computer on 24 seven with reading email every three minutes. And I literally go in there and there's 15 new email that I have to deal with. And then I try to uh, maybe take 50 email and figure out what, what in these are news. And I, I thought I was gonna do a daily blog well, my daily blog means that sometimes I'm writing five or six articles or essays or short connections with people every day because uh, the Internet has just tremendously uh, connected people around cryptozoology.